Hello, hello, and welcome to the workday in life of a video editor. Today is the 1st of July and the beginning of quarter three in 2024. So welcome. To be honest, I'm a little bit nervous because I haven't been filming for about four months, I think, for YouTube channel. I read some books. introduce myself just a little bit if you don't know me welcome to my channel my name is Irene or um, naturally I'm Irina I'm 30 years old I'm working remotely living in Serbia in the city of Novi Sad I'm married and I have Shiba Inu dog basically I started my video editing journey with my own channel which you are on right now most of the time I spend um, at home because I work remotely and I'm a homebody. The highlight of the morning, as always, my small cup of coffee. How my morning starts? I usually wake up about 7 a.m. and now it's really difficult to me because I hate summer, I hate heat, I hate hot weather and I feel really badly at that time. You can see my hair begin to curl and I hate it so much, but okay, we can handle it. Mostly I try to wake up about 7 a.m. and today is a big day, today is Monday. I woke up, I prepared my coffee and I'm having this second cup of it right now. One of my rituals is to put earrings on me, I have the small asymmetric gold hearts from Pandora. And I try to put a perfume so I feel better. I have Molecule 4 today and I kind of love it. That's the uh, last perfume I bought for myself. And then I'm trying to do my fast makeup. And that's how I start my mornings with coffee especially. And then I start to prepare myself for the week. And also I try to schedule or just a little bit plan my uh, personal activities and I have so many hobbies. I love to play Sims 4, I love to read books, to watch YouTube videos. Also I try to ride my bicycle as, uh, as often as I only can but it, it's super hot outside and I can ride my bicycle only in the evening. So usually I plan my week on Sunday but today I need to check what we have here we have a schedule for my future week i need to publish some ads today because i'm decluttering and i need to sell some tech items also i need to pay fee for my dhl parcel and i have two calls also i have my daily planner it's super simple i write down all my plans for today or for the next day and when it's done i just cross it from the list and yes, to be honest, it's sometimes uh, difficult to discipline yourself because I will remind you, uh, we live in a one-bedroom apartment, we live with my husband and now our dog, and we both work from home. Uh, we're working remotely, he's a new UX UI designer and I'm a video editor, so we're working literally at one table. This is a dining table, which now is our workspace. And it's difficult to make shifts, it's difficult to discipline yourself and not to disturb uh, each other. So I have my planner, I have my laptop, and I think I have 30 minutes for myself. And I prefer to read. Also, I have my iPad. I started reading Tolkien last night, uh, Silmarillion, and I haven't read this book for years, and I want to reread this. And then we will jump into my work schedule. Laid under the willow tree, the last weekend of summer, the empire at our fingertips, the you know, as I'm dreaming of a good coffee machine in future, but what we have is like the simplest coffee maker and I'm making American and using cold milk with it. And I believe this tiny cup is third in this morning. Okay. And you know, one of the most important things I need to tell you about uh, having a work-life balance. I'm not a guru here. I'm trying to uh, improve my own schedule. I'm trying to improve my own, my own work-life balance. But one thing is really crucial 
is to have moments of joy through the day. Because if you will be sitting just in front of your laptop, in front of your computer, and only work, 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 it's nothing good in here. So try to do shifts, try to include some things you really love, you really enjoy, and you feel good about it. I try to include reading, listening to music, like singing out loud. I try to include my cuddles with dog or riding a bicycle in the evening because now it's super hot, it's more than plus 30 outside. Drinking coffee is also a small, nice routine. Amazing not to run to the office nine to five and not to have a corporate job, but, but remote job needs discipline. And that's huge. That's a super quiet place outside. We have a balcony in our one bedroom apartment. And I love the view outside this balcony. There's so much greenery. All the greenery you see now on the screen, that's a polygon. And unfortunately, we can go walk with our dog here or ride a bicycle here, but that's amazing. That's a super quiet space. And even it's a polygon, it's really quiet. I came here to read a book just a little bit. And I think I have like 15 minutes um, until I will start my work shift. I try to do shifts like two hours and one hour break, then two hours again. And that's a game changer because that's how I try to be disciplined. That's what helps me. So I'm ready to start my work shift number one. And it's a little bit late. It's 9.35 a.m but we are starting with checking our uh, Apple calendar first. So if you're interested in what gear I'm using for my job as a video editor, um, I have my freshly new MacBook Pro M3 and also I have my SSD, which I'm editing with. It's a SanDisk uh, Extreme Portable SSD for four terabytes. So I have my all editing stuff here, all my projects, all my footage, bureaus, and etc. And also I have my Sony uh, XM, yeah, Sony XM uh, four. That's not the latest version, but I love them so much. They're super cool, and the sound is perfect. I'm back. So what do we have for now? It's 11 a.m. and I just finished my first work shift. I plan to have a 30 minutes like time for myself. That's why I'm sitting in my balcony with my phone and maybe I will answer my personal emails and personal voicemails. I try to stay connected with my friends. Some of my friends are still in Russia, some of them live in Europe or even in the US. And that's hard from time to time because of the time difference, uh, because of the work-life balance schedule and etc but I try. I think 30 minutes is enough to have this like a small break and after that I have the second shift for like about two hours and I still didn't have breakfast. I had my yogurt and three small coffees but I think that's not enough. Maybe, I don't know. Also I want to mention what's done for now. Uh, let me open the notion. <laughs> yeah, I made an appointment for manicure for the next week. I started filming this vlog, that's a win. Also, I started editing my video, which I want to finish today for my job. And I placed a couple of ads, which I was, which I told you before. I think we're good. Also, I'm waiting for the DHL email because I'm waiting for my birthday present. Less than in a month, I will turn 31 and I'm waiting for my present from Europe. So yeah, waiting for it. Hello, hello. That's my Shiba Inu, his name is Spock, and he's so cute. He's asleep because I think he struggles with the heat, like me. Boop, 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 boop. Want to say something? I guess not. <laughs> 
I'm still trying to get used to this new camera because these features are amazing and you can see it can follow me. Here's my laptop. Uh, that's really amazing. The good sound quality, the good image quality, not good but best which I ever had. But we need to be back on track, baby. See you later. My bedroom, that's kind of like a sanctuary for me. And I spend the time with myself kind of often here because uh, it's quiet, it's super cozy with neutral colors around me. I have my vanity here, I have my a wardrobe here, which I declutter a lot each week. And I had a little decluttering session yesterday on the weekends. I already had my lunch and it was super lazy. That's why I just decided to have um, instant noodles, that's all. And now I want to spend some time with myself watching YouTube videos. I love watching Zoe, Sag and Alpha Days, uh, they're British bloggers. And that time is like a uh, relief for me. Then I want to read a book and be back on track. Also, I have two online meetings today, one at 3 p.m. and our team call at 5 p.m. We have team calls every single Monday. That's it for today. And maybe in the evening I will be editing, but I'm not sure. was kind of real apocalypse outside. I never seen this have rain before in my life, I guess. Maybe in my early childhood. <laughs> so, good morning, good morning from me and my regular morning cup of coffee. Today we have another mug and this is my porcelain passion, which you need to know about me. <laughs> I really trying to get used that when I'm planning something, it's not the same in real life and shit happens so it's another day as you can see it's the next morning the 2nd of july i literally could not finish this video yesterday as i want to decided just to wake up today to wash my hair again and to make a little chit chat and describe you how my day was like yesterday so the yesterday's evening was really crazy it was full of little stuff uh, from my job from my friends or from chores. It was like a chaos in my life. Like everybody needed me. Everybody wanted something from me, but I'm happy that I'm alive, that I handle all that. So first of all, I had my team call at 5 p.m. We um, have our team calls every Monday. And that's amazing to see my colleagues, to chat about work. And <laughs> that's a little tradition that my colleague also from Serbia, we always are the first ones who jumped on the call and we always talk about something interesting in our lives. Also, I prepared some stuff for today because I have a little side hustle. I'm tutoring my friend English because she wants to speak fluently, because she wants to feel free speaking in English. So I'm like teaching her a little bit like a speaking class and I prepared our class for today. Also, I sold my Rode Wireless Go mic yesterday and I wanted to sell it for two months and I did it yesterday for the good price and I cannot be more happy than that, but I can, literally I can. Also, I met our landlord yesterday and paid for July rent. Also, I sold uh, two more items from my garage sale list, like I call it. And again, I had another crucial call for me with my uh, other colleague. And we chatted about our plans, about editing, about YouTube. And something exciting will be in my life for now. And I'm really happy I cannot talk about it. But that's kind of my job as a video editor <laughs> yeah that's cool I think that's almost everything which which happened yesterday so I had my dog walk as usual but um, I decided not to take a camera with me because I was running a hustle and my mind was somewhere far away from me not in the 
real present moment. And late in the evening after the dog walk, I also finished my project for my uh, full-time job. So I created a thumbnail, I corrected the sound of the video, and my employer uploaded this video to YouTube. So now it's published and I'm happy that because it's a first video in July that published and I edited it. I have a Notion page with all my projects I ever worked with as a video editor. It's like kind of my portfolio so I can show it to anyone in the future. And I'm so proud of myself, how my skills are improved now, how I grew up through this work. And that's literally amazing. So. I will continue enjoying my morning coffee, that's the second one to be honest, and I wish you a good week. Hope it was not so boring, because I know uh, I'm a queen of talking heads, I really love to talk and maybe someday I will create a podcast or something like this when I'll be confident uh, on it. But leave me a comment below, what kind of job do you have? Maybe you have some questions to me uh, as a video editor, maybe you want to know something more. And if you have any ideas what you want from me to film, feel free to leave a comment down below. And don't forget to press the like button and subscribe to my channel if you want to support me. That means a world for me. And see you in the next video. Bye-bye.